Good morning and happy Monday. I'm Andy Ross. I'm one of the pastors at Northminster Presbyterian Church in Tucson, Arizona. And um, I have two trees here. Well, one is not a tree. This one, as you can see, is supposed to be a red maple tree. I planted these from seeds. Kind of a science experiment. Uh, both have received the same amount of water, the exact same amount of sun, heat, same conditions. This is a beautiful baby jacaranda tree, right? Just in case you were wondering on this Monday, what does a baby jacaranda tree look like? Here it is. And I'm telling you, one day this will be a mighty, mighty beautiful tree. <laughs> uh, I have no idea why under the same conditions, the red maple has not sprouted. The jacaranda is off and running. And I bring up the tree and the non-tree to share a lesson from our schedule of readings in the book of Ecclesiastes. Ecclesiastes is wisdom literature from the Old Testament. And one of the themes running throughout Ecclesiastes is that there are ups and downs of life, good times, bad times, a time to be born, a time to die. And the key of wisdom is knowing that God holds all these times in his hand. That's important. In our schedule today from Ecclesiastes 7, it says wisdom preserves those who have it. Who can straighten what God makes crooked? Uh, when times are good, be happy. When times are bad, consider this. God has made the one as well as the other. Therefore, no one can discover anything about their future. It means we can't take any day for granted. And if it's a good day, celebrate. If it's a bad day, ponder who is still in charge that God is still God, and that God's got you. As we read, God arranges for both kinds of days so that we don't take anything for granted. You know, you may be having a baby new tree full of hope day today. I hope so. Life right now for you may seem like a little bag of dirt. I get it. But God is God. And his love for you reigns supreme. And his justice will prevail. And his truth is like a clear sword. And this God sent Jesus to you, for you, for us. And Jesus experienced the worst of days so that our days will never end. Live by that wisdom and God will preserve your life. Blessings on your Monday.